the worst thing about waking up in the morning watching television in the 80s were these keep fit people. It's cold, it's dark, it's a bit miserable. And the last thing you want to do is get out of bed and certainly think about work. But come on, Britain, wake up, shape up and stretch up. Let's get Britain fit. It was really quite exciting, the keep fit craze of the 80s. I, I have to say that I think I probably started it off. I spearheaded it. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. I remember that morning on Waterloo Station. I was so cold. I just had this skin of lycra on and bare feet. And I started the exercise session with something called the monkey. And I was so thrilled to do it, to get myself warm again. I call this the monkey. Up. Stretch. No warm up. You know, n n none of what you have today, this silly thing called warming up. You just get up and bounce on, throw your arms around, bend down. You know, pull muscles, get trapped nerves, break your spine. Oh, how we love them those people who told us how to keep fit. And the Green Goddess was extremely nice, in a chaste, Surrey suburban kind of way. And hold. One, two. Well, the Green Goddess, I think, was on BBC Breakfast Time or whatever it was called back then. So obviously TVM thought, oh, we're missing a trick here. We need to get someone like the Green Goddess. So they got Mad Lizzie, who wasn't like the Green Goddess. She was mad. Keep smiling. And for the waist as you smile, over goes your right arm. That whole thing that you can get fit by doing five minutes in the morning of just doing this. I mean, if you watch Lizzie, look at her posture. I mean, she's bent over, her legs are apart, and she's doing this. I mean, what kind of exercise is that? You're just going to do your back in. Mad Lizzie and I had a different approach to our routines. Hers were very frenetic and very upbeat. Let's hear the music, feet apart, going to shake up the arms. And if you've only just got out of bed, well, just do it very gently. I think Mad Lizzie's greatest innovation was that, you know, we've got loads of guests here just sitting there doing nothing. Why don't we get them in and join in? It's Ken Livingstone who said, can you possibly help give me some exercises? Instant humiliation for the biggest celebrities of the day. So you bend the legs and from behind the shoulders, you hit in front. In fact, it's easier to think of all the things you want to hit as you do it, and that will help relieve a bit of tension as well. We won't ask what you're I thinking. Won't, I won't do what right. I'm thinking. It was new then, everybody was up for it. It was like, yeah, I'll be healthy for morning. Yeah, this is a we're getting up. It's the eighties. We're off and stretch and stretch. Is this doing anything? I don't know, we're just stretching, Ken, just stretching. Welcome this morning to Cheryl and Jay from Bucks Fizz. Cheryl and I did Mad Lizzie. I don't know what we did, some kind of sideways stretchy things. Very early. Um, it was a bit of a blur, but we did do it. Right, bring up that back leg, face your diagonal, and bend the knees. Are you waking up? No. A few more exercises for them. I mean, it's like, does she know that we have a skeleton inside us that doesn't quite bend that way? I'm sure there's some nutters somewhere who did it, but not normal people.